hold that thought for a second and let's come back to another major topic. And I know you did a lot of work in um, that's polypodium leukotomus, right? And a brand name is Heliokid. It's an oral pill that you can take. Mm -hmm. And uh, maybe you can set the stage and talk to sure. folks about what it is, right? And then we can talk about um, you know, how does it work and maybe we can transition back into visible light protection. Sure. Polypodium leukotomus uh, is an interesting compound, actually. It's a mixture of compound. It is an extract of a fern plant that is grown in Central America. It is marketed here by multiple companies, but the one that has been best studied, and that's the one that I always recommend if I were to recommend polypodium leukotomus, is the Heliocare brand that you have mentioned. Again, I don't prefer usually not to talk about the brand names, but for this particular one, because this is the one, the only brand that has been the best studied one. So if, if you want to use that, that's the one that I would recommend. Uh, and it is manufactured by Ferndale Laboratories. So essentially, this is an oral supplement uh, over the counter is considered to be uh, oral supplement, so it is. Uh, it doesn't require any prescription. It is a, has an interesting property. It it is a mixture of a number of compounds there, and it has an anti-inflammatory and antioxidative property, meaning it has it is uh, a function as an antioxidant also. So what has been found, what has been shown in multiple peer-reviewed uh, journals, uh, studies published in peer-reviewed journals, is that one the ingestion of polypodium leukotomus could decrease the intensity of sunburn reaction when one go outside. And there are multiple examples of people taking polypodium leukotomus, they go outside and they found that they get sunburn less severely uh, and they are less prone to develop sunburn as compared to be without polypodium leukotomus. Our group have also shown that, you know, polypodium leukotomus would downregulate, meaning would minimize, would decrease the visible light induced changes of the pigment on the skin. Again, you know, in, in that sense, it does help to protect. And there have been studies also to show that polypodium leukotomus together with sunscreen would help to decrease the uh, worsening of the melasma, which is the mass of pregnancy that occur usually in uh, individuals who are pigmented, such as uh, Latinos, Asians, uh, especially on the cheeks, most commonly in women, but it can occur in men also. So, you know, there are significant uh, advantages of using that. It is a very benign medication, has been around, a benign supplement has been around for a long time. I mean, it's, listen, um, I can vouch for that because uh, I used to live in New Jersey, New York, when the sun is not that intense. Uh, but when I moved to California and uh, walking on the beach, the sunscreen sometimes just not powerful enough to basically block out all the UV. And and I start taking the pill, right? And the uh -huh. pill. So I, I know it's like a personal antidote. It works. Yeah. And um, it, it's it's also interesting that talking about experiences. You know, when I was at Sloan Kettering for like the last 16, 17 years, uh, I did not see any patients with skin cancer, right? But but uh, in Asians, let's say in Asian yeah. particular, most of yeah. Irish descent. But yeah. coming into California in the last three months or something, I've seen like uh, a countless number of Asians, Hispanics have skin cancers. So, mm -hmm. so you know, the risk is real, right? And I mm -hmm. think your recommendation personalized for the protection strategy makes perfect, perfect sense. And I think 